<laughs> but again, but again, that's a very good point. Yes. <laughs> if if, if are depending on the home based players, they also have they are also very busy. Yes, you know? exactly. The super has taken so much toll of this player that uh, you know it's going to be very difficult. It's all about the super six. Our players have been able to play themselves to uh, the heart of uh, Joseph Pisero. He has been at the Onikon Stadium all through the games, and he has seen these players. And it's time for more players to continue to give their best. According to the manager, the Eagles camp is open for everyone, including players playing right here at home. No matter the stage, there's still room for greatness. No matter the stage, there's a bit of greatness in every man. There's power to rise. I want to commend them. They've done uh, a very good job, in my estimation, because to play three games in one pitch on the same day needs a lot of acumen, organization, and making sure that things don't go wrong. I give them a lot of kudos. They have done a lot of good job. I think that uh, every team that has come here has capacity. Unfortunately, it is not the way you plan games at times that it goes. But however, I do believe that, you know, as the games progresses, more will be seen and because the, the the points are being counted now a lot will be put in, in subsequent games yeah we are getting it right i'm very very impressed because you can see that this is total football the last match um before the uh, on monday and um, but then Schwanz and the other team was super you know it was two two but it was a fantastic game you can see the official you can see everything is way really professional i'm very very impressed with the organizers of the game honestly speaking they are doing very very well but the, the problem and everything lies on the nigerian football federation to take their decision well we do it one that have to take decision on what you want so we are here the FA to come and support you for whatever you're doing. Uh, I think it's amazing what we've seen. Of course, naturally, there are grey areas to things like this. It's everywhere in the world. But on the balance of play, on the quality of preparation, on the level of assessment, I would say it's, it's, it's beyond fair. It's, it's commendable um, what the championship playoff LOC has been able to put together. Um, in terms of readiness, in terms of um, the quality of play as well, I think I've seen some very, very proud moments as a Nigerian, watching Nigerian football. Um, some of the plays have been absolutely amazing. Some of the footballers have really come up, um, you know, to be counted. I mean, because 100 million naira, apart from the money, it is that bragging right. We've seen fixtures between Bendel Insurance and Lobby. We've seen Remo Stars and Rivers giving us one of the best games we'll ever see on Nigerian football at any level. Um, at 92 minutes that game, everybody thought it was done and dusted until two goals in less than one minute. This is good for TV. It's good for the world to actually know that a quality feeling, which is the championship playoff, is here. And I like the fact that it looks like a very viable way to choose who is going to represent Nigeria at the continent. Yeah. Truly a carnival of football is being in Lagos, the MPFL playoffs, as we know, the MPFL Super 6. Finally coming to a close today with March, the five round of fixtures. We are looking at how well the IMC has done and how well they've been able to package the Super 6. Uh, Frank, we've talked about spectators. Even if you decide to throw the gates open, people are not willing to come watch. What exactly are the issues? No, first of all, let me commend the uh, IMC for a job well done in terms of packaging, in terms of officiating, in terms of nation. Fantastic. I think the biggest problem now, the biggest challenge is bringing fans to the stadium. Okay? I mean, even during the league time, you can see that you have fewer people going. So let's be able to unlock that. There's a challenge there. I'm sure that it could be unlocked. Because there's no, when there's a match going on, there's nobody in the studio to watch, it's no longer a match, you know? 
Me, I'm surprised that with the quality of matches that will be played at, uh, I mean, at uh, the stadium here in Lagos, we are not having people to watch. It's a big challenge. We just believe that it's time for us to build from here and also take it a notch further. It's been an abridged version, but I think the acid test remains for these same set of people to take it a notch further, especially when we begin to run a much more expansive season come next season. But if you ask me, we've been able to align our league with the rest of the world. That is what I think I deserve plenty of commendation. We are going on a breather at this point, and when we return, it will be time to sign out.